Steel reinforced bars, or rebars as they are commonly called, have been traditionally used to strengthen concrete during construction. Over time, however, these steel bars may become rusted and weakened. With new and improved technology developed, Canadian company MST Rebar Incorporated has teamed up with Guyana's Ming's Products and Services Limited to introduce fiberglass rebars into the local market. With Ghana undergoing a significant infrastructural transformation, Chief Executive Officer of MST Rebar, Borna Hajimiraga, said that the fiberglass product promises to be a game changer that facilitates longer lasting, more durable construction. So uh, the material you're seeing in my hand is uh, MST bar made by glass fiber reinforced polymer. 82 to 85 percent content is glass and the rest is polymer, which we use the highest grade of vinyl ester epoxy resin uh, to prevent the material from corrosion. The material is extremely light. So as you can see, I'm holding a cage and I can lift it with one hand versus steel rebar that what you see is much, much heavier that I'm struggling to lift with one hand. Um, what you also see, the material can withstand severe and harsh environments. This is a, a salt water that has been added about less than a week ago. And as you can see, the, the difference in the color showing you how much corrosion is happening already on the materials. Uh, the, steel, the, the, the steel bars is showing a significant corrosion on the surface versus MSD bar does not rust. However, even when I take it out of the most severe environments, you can still see how much strength it's retaining. So if I, if I put the piece of rebar on on a, on, a, on, a, on a support and I can go stand on the product and you can see that the material does not deform or bend and it's come back to the original surface. Because of the benefits of this product as opposed to the traditionally used steel rebars, it is becoming the standard. Guyanese businessman and chief executive officer of Ming's products and services Stanley Ming believes that this product can add immense value to Ghana's ongoing infrastructural transformation. Now that Ghana is developing very rapidly with new infrastructure, roads, bridges, etc., it is the right time to introduce a product like this, which will give us the longevity of the, 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 the product that they're uh, producing. If you load a container of steel, you can only fill the container one quarter because a quarter of its volume is the capacity of the container. Because this is four times lighter, you can fill the container. So even though the product might be uh, a little bit more costly at the factory, the freight factor, when you take that into consideration, it, it, it pans out. So you get four times as much product in a container as against steel. The fiberglass technology is also more environmentally friendly and it is one of the modern sustainable solutions that will be on display at the International Building Expo that gets underway Friday at the National Stadium at Providence East Bank Demeraro. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Vishani Ragabir.